Snake! Snake! And we're back. As a scientist, I need to do some research on these soldiers. Um, analyze their behavior when you show them a pack of smokes. I mean, it's an interesting theory and it must be proven so that the scientific community can agree to ban cigarettes from society. So let's see how we can do this. <laughs> yeah. So I'm going to be collecting everything that I can on the, on this lab or whatever. And if I can't get everything then whatever. <laughs> it's really no big deal. <sighs> this room is really nothing to nothing too important, but at least here I'm going to be getting something cool. This guy has a shotgun. <laughs> and there are some sleepy mushrooms next to the tree, by the way. But, uh... Yeah. <laughs> the scientist might see me doing stuff to this guy, so... I need to make sure he's not looking. Looks like it. Yeah, it's a bit risky. So if he comes back, it's then I guess I'll put him to sleep. Alright. So now that he's gone, here's the uh, sleepy mushroom. Whoa. I didn't do anything, dude. And that mushroom also let, uh, releases like a uh, recharge for a handkerchief that we're going to be getting later on. It does the same thing as a cigar, so it's no big deal. These guys on this room is really annoying. I really don't know if he's gonna be like telling on me if I go through the hole. Can't recall that. Alright, so the guard's out of the way. Let me try and get him before he gets. Whew! Got this. Got this. No. Hello there. Uh, <clears throat> let's continue. Alright, so now the guard is all alone. Nobody can protect you from the cigarettes. <laughs> oh. Well, I got saw him, but he'll just awake him. So over here, we're gonna get a face camel. Now that I'll be using it, but just to let you guys know that you can get it over here. And that left side over there is a way out that I'm gonna be taking when I'm done here. Face Oyama. It's like a samurai kind of painting on the face. Your face looks white with red stripes. I'll show it later on. It's just that I want to get a lot of stuff done on this part. Alright, so the guy's not here yet. Good. I'm just gonna get out of here. Whoa. Whew. Alright. Uh, upstairs. <sighs> this guy's kinda tired. Let me give him some food. Alright. So these guys have a source of food. And it's best if we blow it up. Then they'll be kinda stupid later on. 
I think it's necessary because by the time that you're done here, you're gonna have to storm out. And it would be really nasty if these guys were like on top shape as you are trying to get out. So it's best that they're kind of clueless and whatever, you know. Oh, MK22 suppressor, awesome. Well, that's kind of cool, right there, woman. <laughs> uh, what's over here? Nothing. Awesome. Let's get out of here. And there's a picture over there. Hi. I'm not doing anything. I'm just, you know, chilling. Chilling, you know, just sitting here. I'm a scientist. I can just stand here. A scientist with a bandana and a bad beard. You know, just chilling. I smell like jungle, but it has nothing to do with my... with me being a scientist. It's just that scientists never have no time to take a bath. So, that's my explanation. Alright. So, uh, you're gonna be annoying, so go to sleep. And, well, we're gonna use the toilet. Sleeping makes you want to go to the bathroom, so I'm gonna give him heads up. And what's here? Uh, nothing. What about here? Nothing. Decorative toilets. Oh, alright. Nothing. I don't like grinding, but <laughs> it's part of the LP. Oh, what's this? Oh, nice. Like an angel with metallic wings. If you guys know if that's like a reference from something that I don't know, then let me know in the comments below. It's probably just a, uh, an art, you know, it's really nothing, but you never know. And nothing here either. At least nothing for me. So this is a balcony that you can go outside and grab something. Oh yeah, um, I think here is where you get the desert camo uh, also, and since I already have it, then you won't find anything here, so. The game al al always offers you different camos on more than one place, but I, get, I think it's two, t two places tops. You don't get them anywhere else. And uh, over here is where, where you'll find the food supply. Mm-hmm. Alright, so we're getting more of these. And let me put a TNT, but I need to take the uniform off. Also, uh, put it on the floor, but I think it has the same effect. Uh, call Sigan when you're naked. Sounds like the Cobra. No. Next call. The Davy. No. Next call. Snake, what's up? Why are you naked? I know there's a naked option under uniform that lets you take off the upper part of your uniform. But without a shirt on, your camouflage sucks and your stamina goes down faster. You don't get any advantages whatsoever. Sure there are. Like what? It feels good. Man, you do whatever you want. I will, thanks. Just one question, though. What? Is there a way to take off my pants? Say what? My <laughs> pants, can I? Oh, hell no! This fox unit is a nut fest. <laughs> nice. You can have a comment on on all the uniforms, but I mean, you might as well just buy the game and see it yourself. I mean, it's really a long process of calls and long conversations. The only one that I'm getting through are the paramedic movie reviews on special episodes. You can see those on the playlist of the Metal Gear Solid 3 LP. So I think it's best to blow that thing up when you're a little distance from it. Not in another zone, obviously.
guess nobody will suspect anything from me. I'm a scientist, I'm a scientist with a bandana and green pants and boots. I am a scientist. I discovered that snakes are delicious. It's part of a good diet. It's part of a good diet. Okay, so we're gonna blow it up now. Getting naked. I'm naked, I'm naked, I'm naked. The last thing up. Boom! Putting uniform back on. It wasn't me because I am a scientist. I am a scientist. Ha 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 ha. So we're done with the grinding and exploring and whatever. We're ready to go to the next chapter of the story. Well, I'm kind of short on time, and there's a really long ass cutscene, so I'm just gonna get to the spot, and then on the next part, you'll see the destination, the destiny. <laughs> They're already hungry. I haven't eaten so long. So long. It's been like 10 seconds. <sighs> With these guys around, it's gonna be impossible to go so through. <laughs> What's with the shield? I mean, are you really that scared? I'm just a scientist. You haven't eaten, but I'm a scientist. You know, I can give you a snake. A snake, they're, they're delicious. But don't eat mushrooms from the trees, because they, they really suck. Okay? And don't eat poison dart frogs, you'll die. I know you haven't eaten too long, but, you know, I'm just telling you that uh, snakes are good, and frogs have a frog. <laughs> that could actually work if you throw food at, the, at them, at the floor right next to them. They're going to eat it when they're really hungry, so if you want to poison them or something, go ahead. But on the alert phase, it's really not recommend that you do that. So my cigar is filled, is full, and uh, yeah. <laughs> so I'm gonna get this guy because he's the only one that's gonna be like checking this area out. I might as well have him sleeping. Come here, dude. I want to give you a hug. Come here. Come here. What do you think you're doing? I'm showing you my kung fu moves. Do you wish a cigar? <laughs> yeah. I rule. I don't know if he'll he'll be respawning back, but uh, might as well try okay so I'll see you guys on the next part and we'll go through that room just aside bye bye